And farmers in Makweni County have begun to embrace assorted smart farming practices in a bid to improve agricultural productivity and cope with climate change. One such practice is the deep tillage method, which involves loosening the soil to allow for better water penetration and retention. Let's get more from our very own Dennis Utiano on this week's Smart Farm. Smart Farm, brought to you by Equity. Insufficient funds when buying stock for your farming business? Endeleza your farming business by accepting the top-up prompt to complete your payment when using star 247 hash, Equitel or Equity Mobile app. No need to worry when running low on cash when making payment for your farming business. During this short rainy season, the weatherman projected that several parts of the country would receive above average rainfall. Despite this projection, farmers in semi-arid counties are not taking any chances as they employ the best technologies to guarantee them a harvest. Anne Mwema, a small-scale farmer from Kiatine village in Bote, Makweni County, has embraced the deep tillage farming technique to cope with the changing weather patterns. The technology ensures that the available water is retained in the soil for a longer period of time compared to the normal tillage method where farmers use disc plows. In deep tillage, the soil is loosened using a chisel plow. Soils with dense layer are fractured while causing minimum disturbance on the land. After now we've done the deep tillage, we are telling them to plant the certified seeds as opposed to what they were used to planting. And now you can get certified seeds and you've collected all the water in that furrow and you've also applied manure or fertilizer on that furrow to find that the farmers are getting much yields that they used to get. Kwanza kulima hii shamba ya waneka anaweza nilipisha 4000 kulima tu peke na sijahesabu mbegu sijahesabu mbolea sijahesabu watu nitaita pale wanizaidie lakini huyu and deep tillage yeye yeah, alinilipisha 2500 eka mzima yeah Mwema is among a few farmers who have benefited from an initiative spearheaded by the United States Agency for International Development, USAID. The agency is promoting deep tillage method through a program dubbed Kenya Crops and Dairy Market Systems, which targets 100,000 farmers in Kitui, Machakos, Makweni and Taitataveta counties. Mwema has managed to grow drought-resistant crops such as green grams, cowpeas and pigeon peas using this method. The technique has guaranteed her a bountiful harvest every season. I was able to get a single or a single. When I was able to eat it, I got a single round. I got a single season. I got a single round. I got a single round. I got a single round. When I used it, I was able to get around uh, nine bucks per acre by then, my first, first time. And remember, before then, I was getting a maximum of, for the whole farm, I was getting a maximum of five, five bucks per acre. The program also links farmers with tractor providers who offer subsidized deep tillage services. However, deep tillage should never be carried out on silent soils as it increases evaporation. On most soils, it has a high likelihood of resulting in excessive loss of soil moisture. Denis Otieno, Smart Farm. Smart Farm, brought to you by Equity. No need to worry when you run low on cash when making payment for your farming business. And Deleza your farming business by accepting the top-up prompt to complete your payment when using star 247 hash, Equitel or Equity Mobile app. Complete your farming business transactions bilawaris with Equity.